Hello, welcome back to my video for Pokemon Ruby and Sapphire. Today we're going to be going for Bag on. Bag on has a 25% carry. It can be found on B1F2R of Meteor Falls. Now, long story short, it is a little bit of an effort to get here. Make sure you do have some repels going on. Make sure you have a Pokemon that will Surf, Dig, and Waterfall. Those are, well, Dig's optional. It, it just helps get out of here faster, and repels are super handy. Again, Bag on this Pokemon is more or less obtainable after, I think it might be the the eighth gym because that's when you unlock a waterfall so it is pretty very late in the game but it for all intents and purposes might be completely worth it to you and we're going to start in moss deep city and we're just going to head downwards or leftwards and then downwards here um, with our party being equipped with the pokemon we need it is a bit of a trek but uh, what can you do anyway i'm just going to be a little cheeky here and we get to this point i'm just going to use a repel right out the gate it's just going to be much uh, much much easier so you just want to skirt around the edge here. And again, Bagon, it's a fairly decent Pokemon. It evolves into Shellgon and into Salamence. Very strong, powerful Pokemon once they get to that point. You also obtain a TM that is very handy for Dragon types going for this method. Uh, or not this method, but for this Pokemon. And you'll see that it's not there for me, but I'll kind of tell you where it is and where you can get it. So you just want to surf up here. You want to use your Waterfall Pokemon on this. Again, a few encounters uh, by doing this. I think uh, there's one trainer that is a mandatory battle and they just have some Altarias. Nothing too intimidating, but uh, maybe if you struggle with that kind of Pokemon, it might be a little difficult. Okie dokie. So, if you follow my path here, it's pretty straightforward. Uh, again, if you don't follow my path, you might get a little lost. Uh, you can definitely battle those two. Double battle. Uh, I would tend to avoid them. I'm just going to use one more Repel here really fast. We probably won't need the entirety of it, but uh, oh well. There's your one trainer battle. Again, if you come onto my tile right here, right beside the edge, and you just go downwards, onto this, not too far, because you're going to miss your exit. Uh, you want to go into the cave here, or the ladder. You want to use Surf right here. And into the cave in the back room is where we want to go. So all we want to do now is surf across this little pond. Um, and this is kind of where you will find, this spot where I'm standing right now is where you will find um, Dragon Claw. But Bagon can be found in this little patch of dirt or ground here. So we're just going to remove our uh, repel real fast and go for the encounter. There we go, third encounter is a bag on 25%. Again, one in four, nothing too crazy. It's a very interesting Pokemon to find in this game. You think that Bagon being one of the pseudo legendaries, okay, everyone can get it, you know, it's more or less accessible. In reality, you get a level 25 after the eighth gym leader when your team is already low level to start with. It's not the best combination. I just realized I'm kind of out of Ultra Balls. Uh, so we're gonna throw a Luxury Ball and hope for the best. And that didn't work. So now we're gonna throw an Ultra Ball and after I throw it, we're gonna cut two when we actually capture it. Cut on the first ball. Didn't have to cut. I love it when that happens. Makes my life super duper easy. Alrighty. So that is bag on. Um, yeah. So we're more or less getting to the end of the available Pokemon in this game. We might be doing some of the Reggies and Legendaries here pretty soon. But anyway, thank you for watching. Make sure you stay tuned for whatever I was next. See ya. Bye.